Build Divide Gold White Episode 5. So, continuation ng the duel between Naomitsu and Rinpo versus the team of Kika and uh, Hiyori. Now, mga lifestyle if you're uh, not totally familiar with this anime, you should. Because, well, this is the first time we're going to feature this anime uh, as a daily. So, CHD debut po ng anime na to. The, the battle was going back and forth, but at the same time, um, nag, nagkakaroon din ng internal na girian si Kika at si, sa, si Hiyori. Kasi ang punto ni Kika, Hiyori shouldn't stick around with her. Dahil, well, uh, as usual, her reason is, I, I'm the cause of all this. Um, yeah, I caused, um, I caused Sakura's death. And, well, and I'm the main reason why my, why my brother is at the tower right now and he is, he's the king. Eh, sabi naman ni Hiyori, no, that, well, basically, Kika should not think this way. Kasi, the moment na nagkita si Lauli ni Hiyori, he already couldn't find it in her heart anymore to to be um to be pissed off at Kika. Nagkapatawa na yung dalawa right between the duel despite Naomitsu saying na, "Uy, may laban kayo dito. Ano ano ba?" Well, eh, ginagat naman sila ni ni Hiyori. Well, Hiyori just basically told them to shut the fuck up. <laughs> Nagkaintindihan na ang dalawang ang dalawang bida natin. So, they are now hell-bent on beating Naomitsu and Rinpo. Knowing these two playing styles, eventually, they came roaring back and gobbled all the lives of, uh, of that team. Panalo sila. So, final scene. Um, Naomitsu threat still threatened uh, both Kika and Hiyori to, to, be, to be put in battles. But all of a sudden, yung kanilang sutsod na parang yung pintas ni Namitsu tapos yung earring ni Rinpo biglang nagkabasagan. And all of a sudden, these, these two drop like flies. Then, nakita nila sa taas, merong, merong dark figure talaga nakabalot. Pati yung mukha, talagang mata lang ang makikita mo. Eh, nagtaroon na si Hiyori. Sino to? We're gonna break this episode down now, Critics Up style. Base! The Built Divine anime has um, somewhat adapted the style of Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Monsters. Yun ang napansin ko dito sa Code White. Okay? Hindi masyado pronounced dito sa Code Black eh. But here, yeah. It totally reminded me of how Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Monsters' storyline ran per episode. Talagang an entire duel would take a whole episode and in between the duels merong merong uh, merong laglagang nangyayari merong what you call this uh, bistuhang uh, merong may nagkakabistuhan and you would tend to deep dive into those things the pacing on this episode was just like that right so I got no complaints it totally reminded me of Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Monsters uh, at least the first two seasons. Pero, don't get me wrong, mga lifestyle. This anime has a, has a totally, um, uh, what you call this, has its own identity when it comes to the pacing. Flow naman. First gear shift here was when, was the moment Kika said that you shouldn't be um, you shouldn't be with me anymore. Hiyo, uh, Hiyoko, kasi Hiyoko tawag niya. Oh, no brainer of a gear shift there because nagsisimula ng dito na nagsimulang mag-open up ng husto si si Kika. Second gear shift was when 
Ayun na. Nung nagka, nung nagkaayos na yung dalawa in, in dual and the moment Hiyori, Hiyori just told Naomi so to shut up. Well, it was an even more satisfying gear shift because you can tell na despite na sinasabi ni Naomi so na hindi niya kilala ang dalawang ito, kilalang kilala siya ni Hiyori. Final gear shift is of course the final scene. It's gonna make you think eh. Teka! Bakit balot na balot ito? At parang, 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 pamilyar ang, mata, ang mga matang ito sa akin. Parang, gan- I was already thinking that way. Plot wise. Malinis. Patreon, mga ka-lifestyle. Talagang, the whole plot of this episode was centered on the battle scene. Talagang, well, this was the first time that uh, a tag battle was um, was shown in this anime. Pinakauna ito. Walang ganitong klaseng battle nung season 1. It's It was always one-on-one. Now to see a tag battle like this, yeah, that's something refreshing. That's something new for, at least for this anime. So, talagang, pinakoconcentrate sa atin ng Lightning Films kung, uh, on how, uh, on how intense and crucial this battle was. So, since now, panalo sila Hiyori at Kika, and, well, someone has, uh, someone has released control over Naomitsu and Rinpo. They might have gained new allies. They might have regained some allies here. But yeah, it looks. Considering uh, yung kinahinat na ng plot na to, they might, they might gain, they might regain Naomitsu and Rinpo. Baka may balik sa, uh, sa They might uh, have these two return to the fold, so to speak. And only a clean plot will make you realize this. So, base flow and plot. They all came together for this episode, folks. Talagang. Oh. So, Build Divide Code White, episode 5. It's coming to its own now. Two thumbs up! Speculate natin ngayon yung ano, yung, uh, yung final scene. Namitsu and Rinpo have been under Higuma's control. Pero, Siguro na natanggal yung control sa kanila nung tinalo sila nila nila Hiyori at Kika. Pwede. Siguro, yun ang pinakaparusa sa kanila. Or, uh, that's probably the only way to release them uh, from from the king's control. So, yeah. I'm, I'm really, I'm getting, I'm getting positive vibes right now for, for, uh, for these two former allies eh. Mukhang magiging kakampi nila ito uli itong dalawang ito. So, these are two these are two really strong players. Right? Lalo si Naomitsu. Buntik. Well, if you uh, if you're not uh, if you haven't seen season 1, buntik ng matalo si Tero to rito. Kay Naomitsu. Buntik na sa matalo rito. Ganun kalakas ito. So, to have them back as um as one of the good guys, Hong, yeah, you're gonna look. We're going to look back into that gear ship as how uh, how they got their senses back. At saka yung mysterious figure na talagang hindi makani sa isip eh. pa. Parang si Sakura, eh. <laughs> kasi yung yung mata ganon ganon eh. What? Si Sa- Sakura is actually a clone of Kika. Well, when she when Kika was the king, ginawa siya as a clone. Kaya kung titingnan mo side by side si Kika at si Sakura, magkahawig eh. Nagkaiba lang sa buhok at sa color ng mata. So, yeah, I don't know ha kasi either um 
Well, either way, control over Naomitsu and Rinpo was uh, was forcibly was forcibly removed either by the bat, either by the victory itself or by that mysterious figure. So, that's the question we're going to raise the moment the next episode uh, comes along. So, tutu pa more tayo guys, alright? So again, Build Divide Code White, Episode 5, 2 thumbs up. Another 2 thumbs up for Code White, mga ka-lifestyle. Hmm. They've come into their own, talagang, well, better late than never sa pagiging magkakampi nila Kika at Hiyori. So Patreon, wait for my next upload regarding this anime. And for those of you who are still stuck with the CHD, eh, chill-chill muna kayo dyan. There's no guarantee that um, that we're going to review this anime next week. So, enjoy the CHD debut of Build Divide Code White. And, I'll see you in the next one.